Yeah, well, welcome to my channel. God bless everyone. We ran into some problems because uh, the bolts that go on this new after cooler, this after cooler need to be longer than the old after cooler because it's thicker. That means I had to, um, I'm going to have to relocate, put a line here, a quarter inch line, and relocate the uh, governor down here. And all you do is you put the, in, in the hole on the other side, you just put the quarter inch line in there. And then just secure that down with U-bolts or radiator clamp. And uh, <clears throat> also over here, the water manifold's in. Um, as you can see, all the new piping. The water manifold, though, to get the, the high flow water manifold in, you have to take the exhaust manifold off. And be, or the exhaust manifold, you gotta be careful because they always have cracks in them. So if you do, make sure you are prepared to buy a new one or source it like I did from a junkyard. So, um, there you go. It's uh, just a quick peek of what the side looks like now with the high flow in. And we're still working. I have, and there's the suction tube already mounted in there for the supply for the radiator. And we've got some more to go. Be praying for us. I hope this uh, video and you can see the water pump and everything's in there. And But uh, it is a tedious process that uh, make sure you have plenty of patience which I'm running short on. So, and you get the crossover tube now and everything in. So, I hope you guys are that are watching this is finding this video informational and it helps. And like I said, here's another view. And uh, my fuel filter mounts here, so I had to go with extra long bolts um, because you can't get those bolts uh, that it would need to mount through. Um, but back in backyard engineering, uh, here I went with a five inch bolt for these here, but it probably needs to be a five and a half. Um, five inches catch it by about three eighths of an inch. Um, and I don't know if there's enough clearance for another half inch or not. So your call. Have a blessed day.